Hey guys, Crystal here from Crystal's Couture. I wanted to go ahead and show you guys what I carry in my pencil pouch because I know that it can really help different people out. And I really like the fact that I can just bring this with me and not have to worry about leaving anything behind. It is also very slim and it is a Ipsy bag, but you can definitely use whatever it is that you'd want to use. The reason why I chose this particular one here is because it actually sits up. I'm thinking about making my own like fabric one so that whenever I open it, I can actually like open it even wider. But I, I like it. It works for me. It really does. You can choose what kind of bag you want. You know, you could use a regular Ipsy bag or I actually like this one here. This is from Office Depot and it is quite big as you guys can see. It usually stores my planners but I am not using it at the moment. So let's just start off with what I have in my current pencil pouch that I usually bring sometimes whenever I have my planners. If I'm running errands and stuff, I don't bring it. So let's just jump right into it. This here is the pin that I always use and you guys will always see me using for right now anyways. This is a Friction um, Pilot Friction Coletto pin. This is the point four millimeters and it has red black green and black it's actually black but it does look a little bit gray um, it is a friction pen so you can erase it and I do like the chances to erase it so that it looks a little bit more on the neater side so this actually just stays in my planner for the most part so moving on we're just gonna go ahead and start pulling things out and I'll give you guys little explanations as to why I do carry these things around so I have a gold pin in here this is the pilot G2 point um, this is the seven um, millimeter and this is just for like decoration I also have a basic blue pin sometimes I just feel like writing with a basic pin and that's what that's for. I also have a black pin. This is from the Target Dollar Spots and some Elmer's glue. I have the glue in here because I do like to glue things inside my planner. That's actually why I have this out. I glued her in here in the back and I went in with some watercolor and I made the back cover using this. So it does really come in handy to have some kind of glue. And I don't really like the um, roller adhesive because I always have like bad luck with that. I also have a hole punch for whenever I do want to add something into my planner. And some little scissors here. I think they were only like $1.99 from Walmart and they were really, really sharp. They've been working really well. I have a Sharpie fine point just in case I want to write on a glossy sticker and I'm afraid that it's going to wipe off. I have a multicolored pin in here. Um, this one is not friction, it's just a regular one. This is my favorite multicolor pin. It's from Pilot, and I believe it's anywhere between four to six bucks. No, I'm sorry, it's like two dollars actually. I got this pin here from Influencer. This is also a Pilot G27 pin, and it's just in here because I thought it was pretty. I really haven't used it. In all honesty, Pilot um, G2 pins are not my favorite. They are kind of scratchy, but the gold pin and the rose gold pin, this one here, are actually really, really nice. The rose gold I love more than the gold pin. I know you guys are going to be like, what? But I really do like the rose gold better, and you guys probably have already seen it in my setup that I use it for the dates. I have a pink highlighter in here that is just your basic pink highlighter and then I also have a few friction highlighters which are new to the pencil pouch and I do like them again because they are erasable and I only use highlighters for the monthly views so I'll use the pink one for like appointments and stuff but whenever something gets canceled, postponed, or even rescheduled, it sucks still having that block of color. So that's why I got these friction ones and I had to go to Staples, which is like seriously an hour and a half away from me. I have a Michael, uh, Michaels. <laughs> I have a gray marker in here. Um, I'm not sure why. Another basic ballpoint pen. This is really, really one of my favorites one. It's just your generic Office Depot one. I even lost the pen, but it's so dark. It writes really, really smooth, and it is a ballpoint pen. I have a navy Sharpie in here as well. 
I have a few more different pins in here. This one is actually out, so I'm going to take it out. But this is my favorite pin. It is the Inner Gel Liquid Gel Ink in the 0.7 millimeters. This is the ball um, point, but it is the needle tip ball point. And I love this one so much. It bums me out because the cable guy came to install my internet. He asked for a pin. I lent it to him, and he took off with it. So I need to go freaking get another one. I'm so 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 sad but I'm going to take this out for now I also have this that I bought a while ago from Target it's not from the dollar spot but it's like where their office supplies is with like the gold stamp and stuff that's where I got this and then I have my other favorite gel pin which is the zebra on again 0.7 uh, millimeter and this one is really really nice it goes it fits great in my pocket fence fairy so I also have that in here as well I also have a pink marker in here I guess for whenever I want to jazz up some stuff now this wasn't always my pencil pouch so you'll see that I have like some randomness in here I have a couple of refills for my Coletto pin I have already refilled the black one but I kept it in here because I'm a hoarder I have some sticky notes a measuring tape because sometimes I like to measure um, you know things <laughs> obviously I have a Avery like little tab thing and then a green one this here is like a little card thing that comes with like your phone screens to put them on your phone and I like to use this to like smooth things out or to rip washi specifically I have a couple of memory cards in here because I am you know a vlogger blogger whatever you want to call me or whatever whatever you want to call it a little mini like binder clip that is so super cute and then I just have like a bunch of like randomness in here that I'm gonna take out as you guys can see it's just a bunch of junk that has accumulated and yeah I do just have like a paper clip that I do want to keep in here though so that's pretty much it guys that I have in my pencil case and as you guys can see it is actually pretty packed it could be a little bit crazier but I don't want to, you know, like stuff it too crazy or anything. You know what I mean? I hope you guys do. So I just, I'm gonna throw everything like back in here. I completely forgot to mention, I do usually try to keep a mechanical pencil in here at all times, but I had left it out. It fell in my bag, but I do always keep one in here to get rid of like scuffs or for like sketching designs in my planner which I showed you guys in my planner setup and basically like what I want to do if you guys are ever like interested in this for some reason I usually just take the ones that I use like the least and I throw them like in here first you know what I'm saying homie I'm just playing but yeah I usually just like do it like that and then go from there I like having my scissors and the hole puncher there because a lot of the times when I'm planning on my kitchen table while my kids are eating breakfast I like to just have everything like right next to me so that is pretty much it as you can see I still have room to like stuff a bunch more crap in here if I wanted to and I'm pretty much good to go I just throw these in my bag and I am out the door again when I'm running errands or if I'm gonna be out for a long period of time I don't take this because I don't ever use it when I'm out like that but I do like to have it whenever I'm gonna have like more time on my hands so I really hope you guys enjoyed it if you did obviously give me a thumbs up don't forget to subscribe and remember to click the bell whenever you do subscribe so that you can get notifications every time I upload a video so remember that you are loved because I love you and I will see you guys next time bye